Welcome to SmackDown Live, where we are closer to our pay-per-view event. And I don't know if some of our superstars can wait that long. There are rivalries that are ready to explode tonight. The collision course toward the pay-per-view event continues, but tonight, someone's going to hit a massive roadblock. They don't just set the bar, they are the bar. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring, accompanied by Cesaro, representing the bar from Dublin, Ireland. Weighing in at 267 pounds. The Celtic Warrior, Sheamus! No shortage of confidence, and why should there be? They don't just set the bar, they are the bar. Some are saying he's in the best shape of his career right now. Would you agree with that, Corey? It's hard not to agree with that statement, Cole. I mean, just look at him. I'll tell you, he's going to be tough to beat, that's for sure. I can't. Uh, I don't want to look at this guy. And his opponent from Parks Unknown. Weighing in at 330 pounds, Papa Shango. I just got, like, chills. The WWE Universe has just been permeated with black magic. Someone's going to get hurt very, very bad at the hands of this voodoo machine. A superstar so dangerous, he makes Baron Samedi nervous. And this guy is eerie, he's creepy. Why does he have to be here? Because he works for the company. Sheamus is always looking for a fight when he's on the warpath. You better clear the way. And I can tell you that the Chicago crowd has been itching to see this one all day. Oh, Great man. offense by Papa Shango. Rocked him. Oh, what a right. Yeah, that's some attitude behind it. for Papa Shango. No, another reversal. Neither one of them are willing to give an inch here. Good grief, what a toss into the turnbuckle. As the bar, we've seen Sheamus and Cesaro earn success in tag team action. What can Sheamus do to get the advantage here in this match on his own? Um, Cole, have you forgotten that Sheamus is a multi-time champion in his own right? You... Here we go. Oh, an elbow drop. Oh, it's a piercing elbow. Papa Shango just too quick. Boom, what impact. Short clothesline hits its mark. That 
choosing your head. Papa Shango is now in control of the tempo in this match. Training, strategizing, and execution. It's all coming together right now. Vicious shoulder tackle in the corner. Oof, good punch. Nasty. Sheamus looking a little shaken here. If he can hold the line here, he'll be in a good position. We talk about the things that make Sheamus such a feared competitor. One thing that drives the Dublin, Ireland native is his short fuse. Sheamus is always looking to pummel someone. And now Papa Shango is engaging in the time modern WWE tradition of trash talking. Back now inside the ring. Ah, now Sheamus making him pay. And what a reversal for Papa Shango. Stopping down! Thrust right to the throat. Man can't breathe, the man can't fight. I'd like to expand on what Byron said about Sheamus' short fuse. He does not take a lot for the powerhouse to annihilate a WWE superstar. One wrong look or snide remark, and it's all over. Well, if someone has the audacity to disrespect the Celtic Warrior, they better prepare for the reckoning because they're going to feel it. Especially biased announcers, Saxton. Huh? Rib Buster! Big time impact from way up high. Ladies and gentlemen, if you're just joining us, you've tuned in to SmackDown Live. Hits him with a gut wrench suplex. What impact! Hold the hold a slam. Look at Sheamus having a good time. And there's the reversal from Papa Shango. Kick right to the gut. A oh, boom! Oh, oh, swept the leg right out from under. If I was Papa Shango, I would not be behaving like this. Sheamus gets the win. The fiend oh my god, look at that! This is disturbing. 